Hey, what is up guys? Welcome to the video. Today's video is going to be my skincare routine. I've already tied my hair up, I've got my products around me and I'm ready to start. So just a disclaimer, I've got a window over there and today has been like very cloudy. So the lighting is going to be quite off in today's video. So I hope you guys don't mind. But yeah, let's start with the video. So I use a Korean beauty skincare routine and the first step of that is to use a water-based cleanser so if you've got makeup i suggest you first remove that makeup using wet wipes i have these water scented wet wipes from miniso that i got on a haul i shall leave the whole video over here over here i can't remember where it is i'm guessing it's over here but yeah um I don't have any makeup on so I don't have to do that so we're jumping straight into the water-based cleanser so what I use is apple cider vinegar so don't use apple cider vinegar straight onto your face what I did is I took a quarter I think a quarter of the apple cider vinegar mixed it with three quarters of water and I added some essential oil the essential oil I added is lavender so it is in the container and what i do is i take some cosmetic pads and i just take one little cotton pad and then i apply the apple cider vinegar and then i apply it onto my face This does have like a strong smell, but we're not going to leave it on for long. We're just going to keep this on for 15 minutes and then make sure you wash it off thoroughly. Whilst I'm waiting for those 15 minutes, I'm going to use this Pop Feel Lip Exfoliator to exfoliate my lips. I got this from AliExpress. I'll leave the link to this down below. But this is how it looks. So I'm just going to use that on my lips. So yeah, if you have dry um, lips that are peeling, this thing will help take off the dry skin and leave your lips hydrated. Okay guys, so it's been 15 minutes and I've washed my face and now I'm just going to dry it off using some paper towels. So I use paper towels because um, towels build up dirt when it's on display and if you use towels you're gonna have to um, wash it daily so it's easier to just get paper towels and then put them somewhere um, safe from like dirt and use the inside part like this side and not this side to like minimize the amount of germs that are going to go into your face Okay, so the next move or well, step is to use a foam-based cleanser and I'm using this green tea cleansing foam and what you're going to do is you're going to apply a bit of that onto your hand, then wet this. Just add a few drops of water and then rub your hands together until it makes foam and then apply onto your face. If you don't think you have enough water, don't hesitate to add a bit.
So now that I've got this all on my face, I'm going to use this um, exfoliating brush to just brush on my face and well exfoliate. So I'm just going to wet it just a little bit and then turn it on and start just scrubbing. Okay, so now that we have this step done, I'm now going to wash this off and once again wipe with a paper towel. Oh guys, I forgot to mention this, but when you're wiping with the paper towel pat, don't rub because yeah, it's just not good for your skin, it'll create wrinkles. I know I'm young and I'm talking about this, but this is for um, older viewers. If you want to minimize wrinkles, just pat dry when you're washing your face don't rub okay so next thing i'm gonna do is apply so next thing i'm gonna do is apply this intensive hydration toner onto my face i'm gonna take another cosmetic pad and then apply the toner onto them Then now that it's coated in some toner, I'm just going to rub that in. And now that it's coated in some toner, I'm going to rub that in. Toner helps with, well, evening the skin tone, removing excess dirt that wasn't removed by the cleansers and to just even the skin tone i think i mentioned that already but the other thing is to hydrate the skin and yeah those are the benefits of using toner and as you can see there was still a bit of dirt on there and then after doing that you just want to pat that turn it into your skin and don't pat hard just do it in soft um, motions okay so we are now at our last steps which is moisturizing so I'm going to be putting this oil based moisturizer which is tissue oil when applying oils to your face don't use like too much so i'm just going to do two squirts and then I'm going to apply that onto my skin so just massage your moisturizer into your skin And just down your neck okay so last of all I'm just going to apply some lip balm I'm using this honey lip balm that I bought in store and you can use any lip balm that you have at home so yeah, I'm just going to apply that onto my lips after the exfoliating um, they're really soft now and the lip balm would just help make it even softer and even more hydrated whoops okay guys that is it for the video i just wanted to mention before we end off things you can also do other stuff such as putting on essence onto your face using a face mask etc but i wasn't going to do that in this video so you just do those steps oh and what's it called serum 
You can also add serum and you do those steps before the toner and I think the serum you can use it after the toner. But yeah, these are my everyday self-care um, steps that I take to make sure that my skin is nicely hydrated and just feeling good. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I shall see you guys next time. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe and turn on that notification bell so that you're notified each time I post a video. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!